Hey everyone, my name is Jackie Jess and welcome back to the second mission that we will be doing in this series. Uh, the mission is called G's Secret Mission and um, I just wanted to say uh, sorry for the frame drops in the last episode. I think I fixed them this episode so hopefully everything is alright. Please um, tell me if there's anything you'd like me to add in the series or like change anything. But yeah, without further ado, let's just get straight into it and click on G's secret mission. So, G, the brilliant inventor for the Penguin Secret Agency, needs your help with one of his newest projects. What could G be up to now? Okay, let's launch the mission and hopefully it doesn't lag. It might lag, but yeah. Oh well. <laughs> let's start the mission. Uh, here we are in the sports shop, I believe. Um, hello, welcome to my shop. Are you looking for something specific? Uh, I am here to receive my mission. I might have a mission if you can solve this riddle. To find the secret word, look near a lively game pointing to a path with a rabbit in its name. Now, I think I know where this is. So, I have actually done this mission before multiple times, so I pretty much know where to go. So, if we um, actually head out this door, there's only two, two places to go to. So, there's a ski mountain here. Okay, so, as you can see, the names of the runs, we've got Ridge Run, Penguin Run, uh, Express and Bunny Hill. Now, Bunny Hill is basically the place we want to go. So, um, what do we actually do? Alright, Bunny Hill. Let's just remember that, maybe. Do I have to click anywhere? I'm so confused. Wait, let's, let's just head back real quick. Did you find the secret word? Yeah, I think so. Is it, is it Bunny Hill? Uh, do I have to do capital letters and stuff like that? Bunny Hill? I can't remember. Hopefully, this is it. In, I'm sorry, that's incorrect. I can't give you a mission unless you know the word. Okay, okay. Can't I go down any of these? Can't I go down Bunny Hill? Well, let me just figure out what the heck is going on. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Oh my gosh, I completely forgot this was... Oh, I forgot this was a thing. So wait, what is the symbol? It's a green circle. I completely forgot. This was a thing. Oh my gosh. Okay, so the green circle, I'm assuming. Uh, let, let's figure out the code. So it's an X with like the right side cover. So it's M. And then we got O. And then we got G. So we've got Mog so far. Okay. <laughs> and then we got this character here. U. And then we've got L. M M M Moggle? What? I'm so confused. All right, let's just head back over to the uh, sports shop and enter in the secret word, Moggle. You, is, that, is that even a word? I have no idea. This is the word. Excellent work. Are you ready to receive your mission? Yes, I am. Okay. Great, let's get started. All right, so uh, now, now he uncovers the, uh, the sled, it looks like. Your mission is to test drive this uh, new sled. This is my first prototype, so we have to make sure it's safe. Yeah, sure thing. You will need to go to the top of the ski hill mountain to get uh, started. Have fun sledding, but be careful. Sure thing. Let's take it and carry this massive sled in our inventory somehow. <laughs> All right, let's let's uh, let's head up there. Now, I'm not sure which one to go down. Is it, is it Bunny Hill? Just anywhere? The run shouldn't be used for testing. Bunny Hill? Test run. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Yes, I want to test G's sled now. Okay, so I do remember this part. No matter what, you're gonna you're gonna get yeah, it crash. So I'm gonna go as long as possible. Let's see how let's see how far I can get. It it progressively gets harder, by the way. Um. Oh man, I just missed it. Yep. So I've already lost a. I've lost one of the sled legs. I don't know what you call them. The skis. You, uh, I don't know. I've already been skiing a couple times. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Uh huh. Uh huh. There's a couple rocks. Okay. We're gonna dodge. Epic gamer moment. Yeah. Okay, we're in a tunnel. Oh my goodness. This is kind of insane. And I, yep, I'm dead. Epic gamer moment. Epic gamer moment. Ah, oh, okay, okay. Too bad we crashed. <laughs> All right. Wow, that was a bad crash. You awake to find yourself lost in the wilderness of Club Penguin. Wow, that's pretty cool. All right, so we got a survival guy that I must have dropped. Or maybe, I don't know. Alright, cool. So, can I like open it? Oh, there it is. In the top left corner. Okay, it's survival guide. Oh, okay. So, this is just a uh, this is just survival guide with um, Gary telling us some tips, I guess. So, I assume since you're reading this guidebook, you have run into some problems with my sled. 
I have put together a few tips that will help you survive in the wilderness until you have rescued. I threw this guide together at the last minute so the tips provided are not in particular order. So we got stay put, ignore tip number one. <laughs> so um, you should be trying to, trying to find water, food, shelter, a few other things you'll need. Yep, shelter, food, yep, yep, okay. I, I, I want to read through all of these things. Okay, get fire from wood and tinder. Um, heat source. Note, the smoke from your fire, um, if it is a good one, will help rescuers find you. Build your fire close to or inside your shelter. Sure thing. Use what you have to. Yep, so anything from the sled and be alert. Watch for poor marks in the snow. Follow them at your own risk. Although I'm pretty sure the only wildlife you'll see are puffles, which present no threat. Ooh, some foreshadowing we got there. Okay. Okay. Um, I think there's a couple things I can pick up here, maybe. I just, I just broke that mug. <laughs> um, aha, rope. Yes, I can pick that up. I am remembering a couple of these things. Now, I know we can actually collect these puffalo berries. So, uh, I'll collect the two for now. Go log. Hmm. Oh, what's this? Something seems to be in the tree. I can't reach it. Really? Rope? <laughs> I don't know. Um, okay, so apparently I can't reach that. Um, now how do I get back? Where's my starting point? Is this my starting point over here? No, this is full of puffles. Okay, cool. Oh, I, I started them. <laughs> oh, damn. Okay, cool. So the black puffle doesn't really mind. Well, I do have a puffle berry. Do, do they? Okay, cool. They do. <laughs> all right all right now yep he's uh he's uh started to like puffer berry and he's going yeah he's going crazy okay cool so we've got a pet now because he seems to follow us that's that's pretty cool nice now i'm pretty sure this is where we were before i just want to like make sure i map out everything no, no no this is where we were before right okay cool yeah yeah i just want to make sure i'm going in the right direction so if i went back over here right where would this lead me Oh, this is a cave. Nice. Stick. No. Cave. That's pretty cool. Ooh, I found a cave. This will be good for shelter. Nice. Nice. This is pretty good. Oh, okay. I did not mean to do that. That should be, uh, should work nicely for a fire. Okay, cool. I was just like seeing if I could pick up any of the rocks. <laughs> can I pick up this? Yes, I can. Okay. This piece of wood would be perfect for a fire. Yes, it will. Okay, let's just start the fire. I think I know what to do. So if we head over to the fire and put the wood in, right? Okay, that's a fine log to burn. Okay, so I do need tinder though. Now, I, I think I actually know what to do, but I just, I, I remember doing something at the river, but I, I'm not completely sure. Now, there are a couple of items I can put, but I can't use this. This can't, this can't be made for a fire, but I do know what I can use. It's kind of ironic. The survival guide. I do remember this. I just pop it on. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> yeah, it's ironic because it's a survival guide and then you just tear it up once you're done with it. Now, in order to light up the fire, all we need to do, I'm assuming, is just feed um, this black puffle again. And then it should hopefully light up the fire. So it, like, you know, starts creating some smoke and then we'll be rescued, hopefully. Nice. Okay, that'll... Uh, what a nice warm fire. Yes, it is. Okay, can I do anything else? <laughs> um, yeah, it's definitely not a good thing to burn. Maybe try shaking the tree. Oh! Oh, that's how you get it from there. <laughs> oh, okay, cool. So we've got this, um, this pot. This might come in handy. Now, I think I do know where to, um, go now again. Let's scoop up some icy cold water. And I think we should, uh, put it on the fire. Alright, let's go. Let's head over here, put this on top, nice, do I, do I pick it up, now that the water is boiled and clean, you have a drink and you start to feel sleepy, alright, well, looks like I'm falling asleep, goodbye, <laughs> that's the end of the episode, JK, <laughs> you're woken up by the sound of something outside, ooh, where's my puffle, wait, where's my puffle gone, oh my goodness, it's Jetpack Guy, I saw the smoke from your fire and came to see what, uh, who was out here. What happened? I was testing G's sled and it broke. I crashed nearby and decided to wait for help. You definitely did the right thing. Thank you very much. From the look of it, you did all the necessary tasks for survival. Very impressed. Hey, thank you. <laughs> I will take you back to G now.
Thank you very much. You're welcome. I'm just glad that you're safe. Let's go. We're back. I was starting to worry. You were uh, gone much longer than I expected what happened. Well, my sled, or the sled, fell apart and I crashed. The survival tips helped, but the sled needs work. I'm glad that you are safe. I'll uh, keep working on the sled. If you ever want to test another prototype, just come back. All right, cool. Goodbye. Thanks again, Agent. See you later. All right, that is the second mission done. G's secret mission has been accomplished. As a reward for displaying excellent survival skills, you get a medal of excellence. I'll receive the medal now. I received the uh, mission two medal. Nice. I would love to pick that up. Let's end the mission. And we're back in HQ. That was actually, that was surprisingly pretty quick, I must admit. Oh, wow, wait. Can you actually teleport to these places? Well, let's just, let's just see if I actually got the award. There it is. Hopefully, we have like a full inventory of awards by the end of this series. All right. Wilderness Survival Medal awarded for exemplary wilderness survival skills after the sled testing accident. All right, cool. I don't know where my puffle went, though. Where did my puffle go? Oh, Okay. Well, um, that has been it for this mission. Please leave a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Um, to support me and like, uh, support me to continue making these um, new mission videos. If you have any suggestions on what I can do to improve this series, or maybe some tips and tricks, please leave them in the comment section down below. But anyways guys, that has been it for me today. So I'll see you all in the next video.